Hi, I'm Monica Sansu for an excellent lifestyle and nutrition, exercise, and attitude. It's what I'm about. And I want to share with you uh, lentil sprouts and its nutritional benefits and even how to make them. Uh, I made some here and you can make them in jars. They're really easy. All you have to do is soak the lentils for 12 hours and then during five days or so, you just let them grow and grow and all you have to do is rinse them every 12 or even every 24 hours. They're so amazingly uh, versatile. You can use them in soups and appetizers and salads. Just a sec. <laughs> and you can eat them right off. Mmm. 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 They're really crunchy. Mm-hmm. I don't like to talk to, with my mouth full, but they're just so delicious and so mm, <laughs> amazing. Mm -hmm. So, what are lentil sprouts for? Well, the first thing you know about lentils is that they are legumes. Therefore, they are a great source of protein, especially for us vegans. Protein is amazingly abundant in lentils. In fact, we have uh, 7 grams of protein per cup. Uh, you have 7.8 grams of fiber per half a cup of cooked lentils, which is about the same. But when they're raw, they're even better and they're really crunchy. I just couldn't resist just eating the yummy sprouted lentils. And I already told you how to make them. They're so easy. I'm just surprised that I didn't know that before. Thank God I found out how to do it, and now I'm sharing it with you. And it's not only easy and practical, but it's so nutritious. I mean, sprouted lentils are rich not only in fiber and protein, they're rich in carbohydrates. I have a, a little note here, <laughs> uh, just in case I forget. They have 82 calories per cup, which is really, really low. I mean, a whole cup of those amazing, or these amazing lentil sprouts, only 82 calories. So imagine, I mean, low calorie, low sodium, low fat, practically no fat at all. <laughs> you get everything. You get the best carbs. You get exactly, let's see, 17 grams of carbs per half a cup. No, per cup. Yeah, per cup. Uh, that's a lot, and that's good, you know? So you could get the best carbohydrates, the best proteins, the best fiber, insoluble and soluble fiber here, which helps you not only to have great digestion and elimination, but it also helps your bloodstream to be uh, free of cholesterol and all those things so you can prevent all disease and be happy and vegan like I am just uh, using uh, lentil sprouts as uh, lentil sprouts as a great food source it they are really versatile and what else do I have to tell you eight milligrams of sodium which is nothing and the best thing is that they're full of potassium yes 24.8 milligrams in that cup of lentil sprouts and they have iron too come on come on imagine all the possibilities that you can make. In fact, in uh, one of my next videos is going to be with lentil sprouts for veggie burgers. So you can cook them if you want. You can use them raw or cooked. It's up to you. I'm going towards raw vegan, like 80-20, sometimes 90-10. But you know, any way you want to use them, use them because they're so incredibly packed with nutrients, micronutrients and macronutrients, you know, just to tell you the difference. Macronutrients are protein, carbs, and fat. In this case, they do not have fat. You don't have to worry about that. But they're excellent sources of fiber. And when it comes to micronutrients, even some things that we don't know about. It doesn't only have vitamins and minerals, but it's packed with antioxidants that are so good for you. And they keep you healthy and young so you can stay vital, happy. Yay! That's the idea. Okay, use lentil sprouts in all the foods that you want. Uh, I like to use them with avocado and many other combinations of salads. So just add them to your favorite salads and they're going to taste really great. And if you like this idea, this video, if it resonates with you, thank you for liking it, sharing it with the world, and I'll see you on monicastancia.com. I expect, I really would love your comments below the video and on my blog, monicastancia.com. Yay! Thank <laughs> you.